Hey. Hey guys. We have a broom ball game to win. Can we get a ride to the ice rink? Sure, hop on in. Yes. Ice arena, okay. Big broom ball game, huh? Yeah. yeah. Championship. Well, hope you got enough time for something else, because you're in the wreck cab today. Oh, whoa, yes! yes! I love this show. Let's go. This is my favorite All show. Right. So, you might be aware of some of the, the rules we have here with wreck cab. We'll go to the ice arena, but on the way I'll give you some questions. If you get through all of our questions no. without getting three first. strikes, you'll win a prize at the end once we get there. Think you can handle that? Probably not. Well, let's go. We'll give it a shot. We'll do all right. Best. We'll head out here. First off, we uh, would like to get introductions from you guys. So can you give us your name and uh, major? Yeah, I'm Walker Day, and I study industrial design. And I'm Reed Buxted, and I'm studying English education. All right, so our first question here. Lake Laverne is home to two famous animals recognized campus-wide. Can you give me the animals of that we are talking about? Are you looking for specific names? The animals' names, correct. Well, they're both swans. Do we get any points for that? Uh, you're, it's all or nothing on Red Cab here, so we need some names in, in a hurry. Um, let's go with Carl and um, Janae. Carl and Janae, final answer. Final answer. That is incorrect. Um, oh! I, true Iowa Staters, is that what you consider yourselves? Uh, we're fifth, I'm a fifth year? Uh, I don't know if I'd be advertising that. Lancelot and Elaine are our swans over on Lake Laverne. Yeah, there you go. So, all right, on to our second question. The outdoor recreation program offers a wide variety of things to rent. Name five different items that the outdoor recreation program rents out to students here on campus. Kayaks, canoes, tents, Three. Uh, mountain bikes. Correct. That is a recent addition. <laughs> um, we need one more. And life jackets. Life jackets. Life jackets. <laughs> Correct. Way to go, guys. Yes. Got them all. All right. Moving on to our third question here. Like third studio. question here. What is the only BCS stadium in the country? to be named after an African-American athlete. Uh, Jack Trice. Final answer. Final answer. Correct. Way to go. Way Two to go on row. that one. Two in a row. Yeah, you're still rolling along here. Good job. All right, next up. What is the name of the house in which our university president lives? Mr. Lee's house. President Lee. And other presidents in past have all lived at this residence. Any idea? Memorial Union, final answer. Incorrect. It is actually called the Knoll. All right. You got two strikes down, so so you better be uh, getting back on track here. Otherwise, we're gonna have to drop you off wherever we're at on here on the route to the ice arena. All right. The intramural sports program offers four different card tournaments or games during the school year. Name three of those different card games. Yeah, I've named four or three. Three of the four. Alright, let's get an answer. Texas Hold'em, yeah, what else is there? Three card poker, and um... Three 
card draw. Final answer. Final answer? That is incorrect. Sorry, guys. All right, we got we got an option for a save here for you guys. We're all getting close to the ice arena. If you can give us a build out a version of the Iowa State fight song, <laughs> this will save you from being booted out right here at this stop sign. So it's up to you guys. You can take this or leave it. I think we're pretty close to the ice arena. You won't win your prize if you don't do the save. We have to sing a whole verse? You have to sing the whole dang thing. The whole fight the song? The whole yep. fight song? Yep. The whole fight song. Oh, shoot. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I'm really wanting to do that. Not really? Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, good try, guys. Sorry we couldn't... Man. So, we we gave have... it our best shot. Good job. Thanks yep. for the opportunity. No problem. Yeah, we really appreciate it. Go Rex Services. Yeah, have a good rest of your day. Can we go to Jack Trice, please? Yeah, yep. Jack Trice, all right. Sounds good. I think I'm in We got our seatbelt. Welcome, guys. You're on Rec Cab. Oh, yeah. It's a game show we play as we head across campus to your destination. Okay. We'll get you to Jack Trice Stadium. Um, along the way, you have a chance to answer some questions and win an intramural championship t-shirt at the end if you make it the whole way without three strikes. Okay. Now if you get three wrong, on the third one we're gonna have to drop you off before we get to the destination, all right? Okay. All right, all right. you guys wanna play? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Sure. Sounds good, we'll get going. Most definitely. First off, can you, give, can you give me your names and majors? I'm Sterling, I'm a criminal justice major. All right. I'm Alexis, I'm an accounting and finance major. I'm Cole and I'm mechanical engineering. All right, sounds good. We'll get going, we'll get going with our first question here. In the Memorial Union, it is said if you walk across this object, you will fail your next test. Zodiac. Name that object in the Union. Just the Zodiac. The Zodiac. Is that your answer? Yeah. 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 Correct! Way to go! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, got the first one right. That's always good news, so. It's a good start. Yes. We're not going to go for three. <laughs> <laughs> All right, look, on to the next one. Associate Director Gary Greenlee always says you're not a true Iowa State student until you have done this at 2 a.m. in the morning. And this is related to the Recreation Department. Um, sandbags at lead. Is that it? That sounds great yeah. to me. I have For the no flood. clue. For the flooding. Incorrect. So oh. we were looking for intramural broom ball. Dang it. That was our second guess. Yeah. That was a close. That was a close. <laughs> have you guys participated in that? No. Oh well, that might be the reason no you didn't get three. that one. All right. Jeez. All right. So that's one strike for you guys. Ready for the next one here. There are over 50 different sport clubs under the jurisdiction of Recreation Services. Name five of those sport clubs that our department oversees. There's volleyball, there's baseball, uh, water polo. Is that rock climbing or is hockey? Hockey, hockey's club, yeah. yeah. And All right, you got five? Yeah, yeah go with them. <laughs> I don't remember all well. Baseball, water polo. That's two. Volleyball. Okay. Hockey. Hockey. And uh, archery. archery. That is correct. You got there five go. of them. All right. <laughs> That away. Yeah, they always come in when I'm working at fire. <laughs> good, good teamwork there. there we come, go. come through with the clutch. All right, now we're rolling. Okay, let's keep on. Let's keep on this roll. There we go. 
here's your next one. Which ISU Recreation Services facility did I grow up practicing in as a kid? Why is it me? Because you're um, like the biggest Hoiberg fan ever. I love Hoiberg. Uh, <laughs> I want to say Forker, but I want to say Forker. It's all you, man. Uh, we're going to go Forker. The Forker building. No clue. Sorry, that is incorrect. Oh. What is it? It's actually State Gym. Oh. Historical State Gym. It's actually we renovated. We overthought it. We I looked down, down Fred. All right, that was your second strike. So let's not get a third one, otherwise you'll be getting an early exit over here in the middle of this lovely Ames neighborhood. Between Beardshare Hall, Morrill Hall, Farmhouse, and Marston Hall, which one of those is the oldest? Oh, it's the Farmhouse. Farmhouse. For sure. Final answer. Final answer? <laughs> Correct, way to go! Yes! And we have arrived here at Jack oh, Trice perfect. Stadium. Yeah. Great job, guys. Um, you held off that final strike and did not get kicked out early. Awesome. Here is your lovely prizes, the coveted intramural t-shirt. Yes. And thank you, you for playing Rep Cab today. <laughs> awesome, thank you. Appreciate it. Thanks. Thank you. Good job, guys. Hey. Thanks, for Congratulations. It. Oh, you and me? Oh, I don't know. How's it going? Hello. Where are we headed today? I need to go to Beardshire. Beardshire, all right. Got a meeting. All right, sounds good. Well, before you get to Beardshire, how about we play some Rec Cow? Rec Cow, yeah, all right, yeah. let's do it. Woohoo! Now, if you can make it all the way to Beardshire without messing up three times, three strikes, and you're out, and you'd be you'd be out of the Rec Cow wreck cab on your way to beard shear so you might I should have no problem you, you might be that. walking away is it no okay this ought to be easy all right we'll get going um first off as usual we do an introduction so your name and uh, position here at iowa state uh my name is mike giles and i'm the director of the rec department all right all right well let's go with our first question um within the recreation services department last year how many unique users were there of the services that your department provides um, out of our total enrollment here at Iowa State? Out of the 33,000 plus students, we had 25,962 unique users come through our facilities. Is that your final answer? You're going final to... answer. That is correct. Right on the money. Down to the last one. All right. I'll take a good start here. All right. Second question. After the floods of 2010, the Iowa State Daily deemed this individual the master of disaster. What? They deemed this individual the master of disaster. What kind of question is that? Do you have some sort of... I would have no clue. You no clue yourself no were, clue. were named the master of disaster in 2010 in the Daily. So that. I'm gonna say it counts as all three of all your three? strikes. Yep, you You're not fair. Out. Yep, you need to head out. Get out! You're lucky. That's so we got unfair. It. We got around the edge of State Gym. Fair. We saved you a few feet. How's it going? Good. Yeah, pretty good. You guys doing okay? Yeah. yeah. All right. All right. Where, where are we headed today? West Ivy. West, West Ivy, okay. Not Minnesota, y'all. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Welcome to the Rec Cab! Congratulations, right. guys. You're on a game show as we head to West Ivy. I'll be asking you a variety of questions, um, mostly re related to recreation services. If you get everything right, you have three chances. If you get three wrong, I'll have to drop you off on the way. Nice. You feel like playing? I would love I'm to. In. All right. Yeah. We'll get heading that way. All right. Get, first off, can you get me your names and majors? Oh, yeah. uh, I'm Taylor Robinson. I'm a psych and criminal justice major. All right. I'm Allison Bray. I'm a kinesiology major. Option is exercise science. Okay. 
My name is Will Lomax, and I am a marketing major and a kin minor. All right, my first question. The group fitness program has over 120 classes each week. Name four of those. Kettlebell, yoga, kickboxing, and boot camp. You guys want to go with those? Or My name Tess. We could keep That's going. Cool. Final answer, oh. yep. Yep. Correct, way to go. Good All job right. on that one. Alright. <laughs> you got the first one out of the way. Alright. We'll move on to the second one. Name four of the different athletic teams that share space with recreation services in our facilities. Track. Gymnastics, swimming, swimming diving, wrestling. wrestling. Oh, okay. We only need four. Go with those? Yeah. Yep. Those yep. are four. <laughs> Correct. Good job All on that right. one. Alright. Alright. Alright, listen carefully on this one. Beardshire, Friley, Hilton, Parks Library, Eaton Hall, and Jiski Honors Building all have one thing in common. Name that one thing that they have in common. Future, Friley, Parks, Parks, Hilton. Uh, they're Honors Building. What? Honors <laughs> Building. I don't know. I was gonna say they're all new, but Friley's old. Any, old. any, any guess here? They're all big. They're all named after people. Should we just do that? They're all buildings are named after. Okay, I don't know. Um, yeah. All right, need one here. Yes. Throw out an answer, Allison. <laughs> yeah. Taylor? <laughs> uh, they're all buildings on IOC. All right. No, I don't know. <laughs> Sorry, that's incorrect. Uh, You're heading the right direction. They're all named after former university presidents. Oh, oh that's oh. weird. Oh, <laughs> sis. So it's Cat Hall. <laughs> you guys can get kicked out. <laughs> all right, next, next question. What does the acronym... I S U C F V M B stand for. Oh, I've seen that before. I S U C F V M B. College football. Oh, college football. Men. Oh. Basketball. Volleyball. Volleyball. And Let's Got anything? Yeah, men's basketball. Men's basketball. Do you want to do that? Yeah, do it. Iowa State University College Football Volleyball Men's Basketball. That's incorrect. <laughs> oh my God. It's actually the Iowa State University Cyclone Football Varsity oh. Marching Band. Oh. oh. Marching band. Marching band. All right. That is number two on the strike total so you you're playing on the edge of things right now the next one and we'll have to have to drop you off here <laughs> and we're only to highland so you're close to the door that'd be awkward for me to get out first is there like the red light bonus or whatever yeah, we need space all right next question there are six different outdoor space areas that rec services uses for its programs name four of those outdoor areas that we utilize for our programs the Southwest Complex count as one? That would be what we're getting at, yes. Okay. So use that. Okay, so Lee, Southwest, Leeds, Leeds soccer, soccer Field, field. Yep. Maple Willow Larch, Fields. Four car racket, or tennis courts. That's outdoors. Yeah. That's four, that's final answer, right? Yep. Yep. Go with those? Yep. Correct. Good job, by the way. All right, here. We know it All right, next question. NFL head coaches Pete Carroll, Jimmy Johnson, and John Fox all have what in common when it relates to Iowa State? Oh, uh, I know Pete Carroll's dad was at Iowa State. I think he coached Iowa State. Is their dad's coach? I think Pete Carroll's dad coached Iowa State. Pete Carroll, Jimmy Johnson, and John Fox. Let's go with they play their dads coached at Iowa State. I, I remember reading that Pete Carroll's dad coached there. Okay, final final answer. answer on that Or one? he played there. Or which which one? one? I don't remember. <laughs> you 
got it. Coached, too. coached, coached. Yep. Okay. Let's do it. What was it? Uh, that all of their fathers coached here. That is incorrect. No! Oh, we're so close. They were I thought all... he was in the right lane. You were right there. They were all assistant coaches oh, assistant. here. Doesn't that count? Themselves, not their fathers. Uh, all themselves? Yes, yes. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. We're here at the Kaz Bar and we're going to have to let you guys out. <laughs> Great job on the other questions. Hey, thanks. Yeah. Some margaritas instead. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Who is the mayor of Ames? Fred Hoiberg. Everybody knows that. Ann Campbell. Fred Hoiberg. Fred Hoiberg. That would be Fred Hoiberg. Oh, gosh. What is her name? I can see her face. Um, I don't know. I'm clueless. Ann Campbell. Fred Hoiberg. Fred Hoiberg. Ann Campbell. And something or other? I don't live in Ames. <laughs> oh, Fred Hoiberg, of course. Ann Hathaway. Fred Hoiberg. Ann Campbell. Fred Hoiberg. Ann Campbell. Your last question, Alyssa, is sing the Iowa State fight song. What if I only know parts of it? I'll give you the hum here. Dun dun dun. Dun 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 dun. Yeah, okay. We will fight with my or Iowa State. Something, I don't know, ever true. When we hit that line, we'll hit it hard every time I see you. That's all I know. <laughs> the Ames Laboratory began chemical research <laughs> at ISU. <laughs> Rough start. <laughs> Just a second, guys. Do, do a different one. Do a different one. Let's scrap that question. Um. Fine with us. Oh. Yeah, it's done. <laughs> that camera. That's, that's uh, you All hit right. the wrong door. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Jack Tri Stadium. Final answer. <laughs> oh, we <laughs> Correct. <laughs>